Hey, what's up, folks? In this project, we're building an RGB matrix cube with 25,000 colorful LEDs powered by a Raspberry Pi. This is a six-sided cube that features 64 by 64 high-density RGB LED matrices. It's driven by a Raspberry Pi 4 with an Adafruit matrix bonnet. We have some beautiful demos like this flowing pixel sand demo, which uses an accelerometer for a mesmerizing motion effect. The grains of sand trickle down and move across all six panels, making this physics toy unlike anything else. To drive all six panels, we're using a Raspberry Pi 4 computer with an Adafruit RGB matrix bonnet. This little add-on board makes connecting RGB panels with Hub75 easy to plug and play. We made two different sizes of the cube and both are documented on the Adafruit learning system. The bigger cube features 2.5 millimeter pitch panels with built-in curb cut frames for an easier build. The smaller cube uses two millimeter pitch panels and has fully 3D printed frames. It's tougher to construct, but it's the smallest pitch possible. Both cubes feature neodymium magnets, making the panels easily snap fit together. To power the cube, we're using a five volt, three amp USB battery bank. It's compact and small enough to fit inside the cube alongside the data and power cables. This version of Conway's Game of Life was specifically written for the cube to allow the cells to travel across all of the panels. For static displays, we have an image viewer demo that you can use to better understand the cube's typology. Once you've gotten them in the right format, JPEG and PNG images can be displayed. You can experiment with all sorts of texture maps, no matter how bizarre. The globe demo takes images like the Earth and projects it onto the cube while spinning and animating. You can try this out with other planets like Jupiter, the Moon, or even the Death Star. There's an option to wrap the texture vertically so the polar caps are mapped to the corners. Be sure to check out the guide for a full step-by-step -step tutorial on building your own matrix cube. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe for more projects from Adafruit.